Hello, and welcome back to Soulmate Saturdays. In today's paid card reading, we're going to be looking all into what your soulmate looks like. We're going to check out their appearance. So we've got three cards here, three crystals. And so here's where you're going to decide which crystal you feel most drawn to as that will signify your reading. So the first one I have up is the blue calcite. We've also got some angelite here. And we've got celestialite over here as well. So I want you guys to just take a moment and feel which crystal you're most drawn to. If you need an extra second, you can pause the video. And once you decide on which crystal is for you, you can jump ahead to the um, in the description of the video because there will be timestamps in the description. But let's jump on in. The first reading. So if you chose the blue calcite crystal, then this is your soulmate's appearance. Okay. All right. So let's see what your soulmate looks like. Okay, let's see if we get a couple more cards too. Okay. All right, we've got the sun. I could literally live some more warm. We've got the five of cups, seven of wands, the ace of cups. Oh, we've got a bunch. Page of pentacles, eight of pentacles, and the king of cups. Okay. Okay, so very interesting because these both came out saying the same thing. So we've got young woman or young man, right? So depending on uh, which gender you're attracted to, to 25 years old. So this is more of a younger soul. Um, so this could be somebody who's very young at heart. It's, it also does feel like no matter how old they get, that they still can keep tapping to that, like, I can tap in that childlike nature and I can stay very vibrant and young no matter my age that's not going to restrict them um most likely a darker hair we're going to have a darker hair let's see what else we got i see a very slender nose and a very bold jawline so a bold jawline um very interesting because i know we're not that's not coming up but it's um I heard childbearing hips, and so even if this is the man I'm picking up on, to me that would signify somebody you're going to have children with. Um, let me see what we've got. The skin is a little bit... Um, it's not too dark, but it's not fair. It's... Um, it's a very, very light... Light this is a good it's a little it's like one shade darker than this because I feel like he's still a little bit fair I don't want to say it's dark skin it, it's 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 got a golden glow to it so there might be a tan um yeah especially if you live in the sun so the sun may be bringing an extra color to it making it a shade or two darker because I was like why is it so I'm like, it's not brown, and it, but it's like this golden brown, but it's not, there wasn't like, it, it's probably more natural, right? And so that's probably from the sun because I was trying to tap into, um, yeah, the skin color, but I think that that's the sun's bringing it the darker glow because it's like this golden brownish energy, the skin, um, To be honest, this might even be a Taurus. Um, give me a second. I'm just tuning into the cards. We've got the slender jawline, a slender nose, the nice jawline. It's interesting because it, it feels like underneath it all, there would be rosy cheeks. So I don't know if that makes them blush easily or like, hey, makeup can kind of cover that up, you know, for the females. But even the tan from the sun could could cover it up because it's like, oh, um, yeah, I think the sun covers it up. where You can't quite see those rosy cheeks. They might have some blemishes, meaning like more. Um. What is that called? Is it called rosea? I have no idea. It could be a skin dis, 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 
uh, it's not like a skin disease, but like there could be like red blemishes on them. Um, not like a birthmark. It would be, it's not eczema. It's, I don't know also call it, but red blemishes. I think they definitely, I think their cheeks get rosy because they blush a lot, but they might have it. It might be in their arms or somewhere else in their body, but there's something about these reddish. Oh, maybe they're susceptible to breaking out on hives, but I don't know if that's going to relate to all of you. That might just be a little side message I'm getting because they can see these red blemishes. There's not, they're not all over the body. It's like one or two, but I also think that they get these rosy cheeks. Um, oh, the darker hair is it dyed. There's a darker hair here. I'm definitely picking up on that for sure. And actually everybody basically in here has the darker hair too. Uh, I was mainly pulling from this, but you can see almost everybody here has the darker hair. Um, so for some of you, it could be dyed, but it doesn't have to be for all of you. Because again, we're all going to have different partners here. Hair, we did height. We did build, skinny, tall, more slender. Very curious individual. We'll throw that out there as well. But I think for their looks, we, I, we've we gone over most of the images. So yeah, card one, here is what your soulmate looks like. And we will jump on into card two in just a moment. All right, let's shuffle up this deck again. If you, let me pull that up here. Okay. If you chose the angel like crystal, this is your reading. Let's look at your soulmate's looks. What do they look like? Very interesting because I know I'm going to just focus on looks, but there's a little bit of like a space cadet. Um, they probably need some grounding. Uh, it's all in the head. There's a little bit of like... They might even have some decongestion issues as well. I don't know. This is just what I'm getting. So we've got the Page of Wands. Could be around um, middle age. Um, not meaning, I'm not, I did not say that right. Is it quarter age? What's the 25-ish? But I feel like it's more around 29. Because it says 225 years. But again, I think we're at the end of the 20s here. Um what else do we got? God, there's a little bit of sadness around them. Let's get into their looks. Let's get two more cards. Okay, we'll take all of these. That's fine. Okay. Six of Cups. Eight of Pentacles. Definitely a hard worker. And the Death. Okay. Could be dealing with the Scorpio here. I think they're quiet. I think they're a little timid. I think they have a lighter skin. Uh, I think they're average height, to be honest. Somewhere between 5'6 to 5'9. Uh, even maybe 5'8, but I don't think they're taller than 5'9. Even 5'6 is a little... There's somewhere in there. It's probably like 5'7, 5'8. They're right there. It feels a little bit of average. Honestly, they're so... I don't... Listen, this is what I'm getting. It's like it's so average that they could blend into a crowd. It's like, oh, yeah, just another Joe Schmo, right? Um, I think they have glasses. I think they have darker hair. It's short. It's short, whether that's a woman or a man. They're short hair. Very curious about life, but a little bit, um, uh, not speaking out about it. Um, I think the nose is a little bit wider. I think, um, uh, there's a little bit, there's a little bit of weight in the cheeks. There's a little bit of weight in the cheeks, but it, the body's not like overweight. It's just a little bit in the face. I could see it a little bit. Um, going in, the hairline is going back just a little bit. If it's a man, it feels like the baseball caps are doing it. But if it's a woman, it's probably just a big forehead. Um, let me keep going. Let me see the nose, the face. The lips are a little bit thicker. They have a little bit of thicker lips. Okay. Um, a Sorry, I'm just tuning into what Spirit is saying. Um, 
because they're they're not real it's not like stick, stick skinny it's not slender but it's not there's no real overweight on them it's not like there's muscle it's not like i have this flat stomach but there's no it's not like a belly it's 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 really average and i'm sorry i don't want to just say that but this is the image i'm getting that it's just it's healthy though right because it's not really overweight but i'm not really underweight and i'm just right there i think to be honest um they're gonna have green eyes Okay, I'm just, okay, so, just tuning into the cards, this one's got a lot to say, I think it's a darker skin, Their name's a little bit ordinary. It's not like the very common name like Mike or Joe. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, they're a peaceful energy. Okay, hair. Uh, face, nose, lips, body weight, size, height, eye color. Yeah, card two. I think we got yours. Yeah, beautiful. Okay. Card two, this is your soulmate appearance. Okay. All right. And let me shuffle this up and we'll move into card three. Let me see. If you chose the calcite oh no sorry i'm sorry beep, beep, beep. rewind delete let's start over <laughs> if you chose the celestialite crystal this is your reading what your soulmate looks like all right let's get some details about what the soulmate looks like okay High Priestess, King of Wands. Six of Pentacles. Three of Cups. Very motherly. Let's see what else we got. Okay, so we've got green, green to blonde hair so far. Over 25 years old. They're a very calm, neutral being. And that's how a lot of people view them. Let's see. The only thing else going on is a little bit restless in their thoughts, but let me see back the looks. They've changed their identity somewhat, meaning that they could have had a nose job, they could dye their hair. They're somewhat like, like maybe they have fake nails. I don't know. There's some energy of like a, a fake false facade where i can't even see their true essence um they could have colored contacts to be honest i really want to lean into that one there's the nine of wands yeah a little bit of insecurities there let's get one or two more cards there we go okay <clears throat> eight of cups knight of pentacles okay Oh, God, they might have had a rough upbringing, too. Okay, let's get back to appearance. Um, I don't think they're the tallest. They're, 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 like, 5'4 to 5'6. They're probably under 5'7. They're not super tall. Um, why do I keep hearing the word janky? I don't even necessarily know what that means. I mean, I kind of do, but, like, I'm trying to relate how that means in here. Um... They, they, they constantly keep trying to cover up themselves. So as a woman, they could always wear makeup. Um, I think that they wear glasses, but you wouldn't know that because they always have contacts in. 
let me go through i see some wrinkles on their forehead when they squint and it's kind of cute because when they laugh it comes out they don't see it as something cute but i think you would small hands small ears lips are tiny too probably more slender too this is somebody that's a little bit more slender not like underweight but um slender there's always like these tall slender beings and i'm like no it's a little bit short but it's slender and i like it um the stomach's flat whether it's a man or woman it's good it's flat it's 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 not even like muscle but it's just flat let me see they got something going on with their wrist i think they had like a injury to their arm or it could even be going up to their shoulder i don't know it's the elbow something they had some kind of injury it's affecting their their i could see with their arm there let me see they might have a lot of scars quite a few scars let me see very interesting i keep asking about the nose and they're not showing me anything so that literally could mean a nose job or it could have been broken right and so maybe it got reset or something but every time I go to see the nose, I, I see her an eraser, so it keeps being erased. So to me, that means there's some kind of injury or they've had an operation. Um, the ears, it's like hard to hearing, but I don't think they like wear a hearing device. I think it's more. Um, I don't know how to explain that. Because there's something going on with the ears. I don't think it's any health issues. I don't think it's a thing to be cautionary. Like, here's what I was kind of feeling. It's like, oh, you need to clean the wax out of your ears. But, if, I mean, honestly, if you ask any doctor, they tell you not to use Q-tips. So, I'm like, I was, like, hesitant to say that. But, again, it, um, I don't see it as a health thing, right? It's just, maybe they just know how to tune people out. It, it might, yeah. There's something funny with the ears, though. But it's like, hello, I'm talking. Are you listening? Oh, sorry. What? It might just be them. Um, trying to see. Their hair is probably in many colors because I tune in the hair and I just see a wig taken off and a wig taken off and a wig taken off. So they probably have changed their hair color a lot. Um, I think they are like dressy and flashy. So I like to dress up. So if it's a woman, it could be like skirt and heels a lot. If it's a man, I want to wear like a suit or a tie. Or I just want to be like sharp, right? Um, business, financial, like I want to look just the part or something. But I think that they always like to look good. Probably spend a lot of money on clothes. Could be into some designer stuff. Let me see what else we've got. Somebody's desiring marriage big time. They probably have got out of a rough marriage, but I could see the hand and it's like missing the ring. Um, so they definitely want to get married. I don't think there's any kids with this person. I know this card says, does it, does it say, it says green eyes, but when I really look in there, oh, I'm seeing, oh, that's, I was like, I'm seeing blue. And so their eyes could change in green and blue, unless there's like blue contacts, because I, I'm like just focusing on what spirit's showing me. I'm seeing blue eyes, but the card does say green eyes here. So I'm going to throw that out there. But again, I may not be seeing their true natural self, because I think it's a lot of like, showy i've changed stuff i dye stuff i do stuff to my appearance so i'm like what's underneath the surface there like who are you right um i think it's a lighter skin tone though probably european is what i'm picking up on okay height hair i can't even tell it's, it's been dyed so many times uh, i think it's um I don't know if it's naturally blonde or if it's blonde now, but I could see just wigs, wigs, wigs. I'm going more into blonde, probably blonde when you meet them, unless it's the roots coming out. But um, I'm going to go with blonde. We did hair color, eye color. Let me see. Nose, lips, height, weight. I'm just going through everything to see if I missed anything. Arms, legs. I think, I think, I think card three. I think card three, we got your appearance. All right. So we'll wrap up the reading right here. And that wraps up all the readings. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you've got anything out of this video, do me a favor with that thumbs up button this way. I know you've got something that resonated. If you guys haven't here, subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And there's a bell too. I want it the bell. You want to hit the bell and turn on all notifications because I do daily videos. And I don't want you guys to miss out on any upcoming messages. That next message just might be the message that you need to hear today. 
All right, my loves. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be blessed.